All right, super quick, super basic tutorial here, just how to incorporate a customized sharpness setting into Off The Grid, just to clear up some of that blurriness, because a lot of us did notice once the config was gone and we couldn't use it anymore, the image was really, really blurry. Uh, hopefully we'll have a sharpness setting in game soon, but until then I would go with this method. It is only for NVIDIA, so if you're on AMD, watch the video anyway, see if you can replicate this in the AMD control center somehow. If not, just stick to your FSR because FSR includes uh, sharpness already. So I'll show you a couple examples of what different sharpness settings look like, and then we'll just get into how to do it. Okay, so to do this, it's pretty easy. First, we just go to NVIDIA control panel. And when we go here and we go to our Manage 3D settings, we can see in uh, global or program settings, we'll be using program settings, obviously. But you see here this image scaling section it just says use global setting. And then when we click on it, it says GPU scaling and sharpening. And I was thinking, I would really like to use the sharpening, but I don't want to use the GPU scaling, which is basically a software upscaling method similar to DLSS, but nowhere near as good. And I was wondering if there was any way to turn this off, and there actually is. So what we'll do is we'll just leave this alone for now, but we'll quickly add the off-the-grid executable to the program list here by clicking Add. And then just before you click Browse, you'll want to go to Epic, click on the ellipses, click Manage, and then click here where it says Open Installation Location. Then come down here to G01, double-click, binaries, Win64, and then here's the EXE. So we'll just copy this address and then put that in here. It won't take you straight here. It only does it for me because I'm awesome. Uh, but we just go here and then press enter and then click on GA1 client, Win64 shipping and click open. And that way you've actually got off the grid there in program settings. We don't have to worry about it. But let's go about changing this image scaling setting to actually just sharpening. So we'll close that for now. Close this. And we're going to go to registry editor. So type in reg edit, or we can just type in reg. And then open it up. And then I'll put this address in the description. So you can just copy and paste that up here. But I'll get you to do that now. Just go down to the description, copy this address, and then paste it in up the top here. And then you'll want to go to, well, first off, we'll stay here in the older we're in now parameters FTS. And we're going to scroll down looking for enable G53, G535. Yes. So double click it and change it to zero and press OK. And then go up to this folder, FTS, and just do the same thing. G, uh, GR535. There it is and just change it to zero. Once you've done that, just click OK, close the reg edit, and then go back to NVIDIA control panel. And see, now it says sharpening off, scaling disabled. And that's, that's pretty much it. You just, oh, okay, it's actually remembering my sharpening settings from before, but this will probably say off. And you'll just wanna go in. I'd probably recommend if you're playing at 1080p and you're not using any upscaling or you're using upscaling at the highest possible setting, let's say it's ultra for you, or you've got native AA available. Either of those, that's fine. Uh, but I'd probably say aim for 45 and then see what different ones look like. Uh, it should definitely be mentioned that it would be unwise to try and use this with the FSR scaling mode in the game, because the FSR mode it already applies sharpening. And in my opinion, the FSR mode is like, it's just crap. Like the performance it gives you is just not very good. The frame pacing is terrible. Uh, it might be different on AMD GPUs, but if you're using an AMD GPU, then you know, this tutorial is gonna be a complete waste of time for you, unfortunately. But yeah, just play around with the different sharpening values. You could probably go all the way up to like six, maybe even 0.7 at 1080. Uh, I don't know, that's kind of pushing it. If you're bringing your resolution down, let's say you're using like performance, the performance setting on DLSS, or your resolution's like 1600 by 900 or something, or 1600 by 1024 maybe. Yeah, maybe then you can crank it up, but just 
just start with 0.45, see what you think, play a game. If it doesn't look like enough, you know, crank it up to something a little bit too high, like 0.7. Hop in a game, see what you think, you know, maybe just hop in the uh, test range for that, but, you know, just just play around with it. You'll need to restart the game each time you change it, though. But, yeah, that's basically it. All right, peace.